Here we are in a new web app called Dropmark, and I am currently uploading a video. You can see I've uploaded a couple of photos already. And I did that just by grabbing a file from here. Let's just uh, find something really quick. Dragging it in and letting it upload. And then when it's done uploading, it will show up in this collection. And collections are neat. You have, uh, you can do whatever you want. This collection is currently empty. But say if I were back and forth July cake and thought for some reason this uh, photo belonged in new things instead, I can just drag it in and there it is now in new things. But we don't really want it in there because it's part of this, so back into the 4th of July cake. So you can organize things really well in different collections and your collections are basically um, private by default, but you can just click that, change it to public, so anyone can go to this URL um, and access it. Of course, uh, you can also share it if it's private with other people. You can see I've added Wits in here. I could delete him and then just add him again by typing in his email address. So one of the neat things, aside from being able to just rearrange things at will here, um, you can uh, use this as a means of creating really simple but nice presentations. So if you click on this, I can go through and do a little slideshow. If you were doing slides, you could do this um, at full screen and give a, a presentation that you just threw together really quick in the web. Run through all our files here. And, you, and then when you have other files it doesn't support, you can just download them. And of course, you know, if you have pictures or whatever, you can zoom in on the pictures and click this link to actually get to the official file itself, the full file, for people to download. So that's pretty cool. Drop, so Dropmark is basically a very straightforward, simple um, file sharing service that lets you create different collections, uh, manage your privacy settings, blah, blah, blah. You can sign up for an account that gives you 250 megabytes of free space, uh, or you can pay, I believe, $48 a year for 25 gigabytes. I think that is the case, but let's just take a look. Yes, 25 gigabytes for $48 a year. Okay, so that's cool. What's also really cool is if you have Chrome, um, there's a Chrome extension. And you can click that and it brings up your sidebar with which you can do similar things as the website. But if you don't want to be going to the website all the time and you just want to bring up your file sharing, you've got it right in your web browser on any website. And then it will add the files just like that. And you can hide the bar when you're not using it. I suppose that would actually hide it. And then you'll see here I've made changes. So that's Dropmark. It's really cool. You can go to dropmark.com to sign up for free and give it a try for yourself.